what's going on coming at you again with another chaos theory this we're halfway through it we did all the jurassic parks and now we're going to be working on the jurassic worlds um up next though is jurassic world we get to have the mosasaur indominus rex and the raptor squad and this one's going to take a few episodes um there will probably be a lot of off-cam construction and incubation, you name it, but let's jump right into it and get, get rolling, get some money rolling. This is where our journey continues, and for many, where theirs came to an end, Isla Nublar. This time, it's not just a park. It's a world. Simon Mizrani believed he could succeed where others before him failed. Maybe if he had you there to guide him, things would have turned out differently. Jurassic World, Jurassic World was to be the most desirable destination on the planet. New shows, new exhibits, and yes, new dinosaurs too. The miracles of science meets the magic of entertainment. I'm not content with letting you see dinosaurs. No, you're being put smack dab in the middle of them. Safely. That was the hope, anyway. And who's afraid of a little water? But what's swimming in that water? Well, that's another story. And if that's not enough, what about the dinosaurs nature didn't create? John Hammond had his vision, and I have mine. I'd like to think that had things been different, he and I would have been good partners. His passion combined with my business savvy. It would have been quite the team. But alas, it was not to be. And I was left to pick up the pieces of what might have been and turn it into what should have been all along. A premier world-class tourist destination. The only place on the planet where you can experience dinosaurs up close and personal. Here, people will once again discover the wonders of this world. They will have a renewed sense of life, and they will gladly, willingly, eagerly pay for that experience. Science didn't bring back dinosaurs. It brought back possibilities. Hope. This is what I see. This is Jurassic World. Hey, Cabot Finch at your service. Well, actually, I guess you're kind of at mine. <laughs> Details. I've been tasked with getting Jurassic World ready for the public. With your help, of course. We'll begin with a science center. And it will have to be powered. So, get to doing the service thing. All right, so my game plan for this Chaos Theory, the Jurassic World one, since the map is so big, my game plan is to actually make it look decent if I have the cash, and I know early on I probably won't, but I like flattening everything and then making terrain adjustments to myself. But this map is massive. So. I'm going to try my best to make it look pretty. Tell me I'm pretty. Stick that right there. Okay. And this. I need five. Uh, okay. So that's good. Faster research probably. Still not enough. Shoot. How many scientists can I have? Three. Okay. 
We'll do cheaper too. Oh, it needs to be operational. That is stupid. Oops. Okay. Okay. Things are taking shape. But we need a response facility. Oh, and a paleo medical facility as well. Get it built and ready. Okay. Response in Paleo, okay. I have to do research on both of these? That's kind of stupid. We're gonna lose money quick. I don't like this. At least I don't have to research that stuff. Put the power over here. That's not what I wanted. Stupid. Okay, well, while that's going, I guess I could do this. Uh. Bah, bah. That works. Okay. Okay, we got some core buildings out of the way already, so that's good. Okay. We'll start off with just two. I really like the way my uh, Jurassic Park Chaos looked, so we're gonna try and stick to that looking nice. Now that we have these dinosaurs, stick to that looking I nice. Want them in I want it to look that nice. Explosions. These assets are central to our operation. No dinosaurs, no Jurassic World. Please remember this and act accordingly. Okay, now I know all the herbivores that I get can go together, so we'll just make one massive enclosure. Food, water, and drink, food, drink, and clothing.
and we'll get a power station, some s a substation going. We'll get it going like so. Transit. There we go. Now I just need the Rex. Nope, not yet. Now this is going to suck because I know... The Rex is going to be another race to three and a half stars or whatever the case may be. But we'll do our best to try and not have that problem like we did in the San Diego map. This isn't going to be perfect. I don't want the enclosures to look like they're square, so it works out. this skin what skin is this blank with okay nice I already have herbivores breaking out First things first. Let's do these guys too. That's not what I meant to do. Okay, and then ground fruit. And then water. And then we'll put water down there. I don't know why you guys are attacking my fence. Okay, the Rex is happy. Why? You're 100%. You should be happy. You should be golden. Same with you. Jurassic World is the envy of okay. the world. Where else can one travel to see wonders such as these? And they must That's be seen. stupid. So do what you can to increase our dinosaur visibility. I want to make sure our guests have okay. comfort. We should construct bathrooms and other things in strategic locations and some emergency shelters, just in case. Alright, let's open the park. 
It's a beautiful day to open a new chapter in the history of humanity. Once these gates are open, there's no going back. I agree with Wu. <laughs> Never thought I'd say that. We're ready, Mr. Masrani. This is it. Jurassic World. I can't help but wonder what John Hammond would think of all this. I think John Hammond would think you're crazy. Should have left him on site B. Why? Why could be like that? We want to ensure that our guests are having the best Jurassic World experience possible. Increasing our amenity coverage should do the trick. Keep an eye on our guest comfort numbers and get them where we'd like. And that is up. Probably swallowed a, a phone. Uh, if he did, I'd have to put stick him in the MVU and guess comfort okay sprain I think he'll be fine okay Here we go. The last of the viable candidates from Sorna are arriving. Let's get them settled in. Large hotel. Okay, now I want to take a peek at this research. So this is what I could get for carnivores. Which isn't terrible. Indominus Rex. Okay, those are good dinos, good. Oh, the Carnotaurus is on this. Okay, cool. Okay. Okay. Um, yeah, three and a half stars is when things will start getting good. T-Rex is actually only three stars. That's good to know. And I'm already almost at one and a half. I already checked that out. Can I get the Quetz to run it on? Nope. That's okay, though. Oh, I can do the zipline. I was going to say, I swore I saw that earlier. Got to get a staff center, like ASAP. How much am I paying? Only 46. Okay. Um, I think once I do this and once... He asked for either a Mosasaur. I think that's the next big thing. I will call the episode and do a lot of off-cam stuff. To be as new and upgraded as possible. The more buildings, the better. The better the buildings, also the better. Let's 
Let's get these galleys in here. I kind of like how this looks. A little open area. It's nice. And we are making money. The dinosaurs, visibles, 9 of 13. Total appeal is at 9,000. The Jurassic Park one or the San Diego one. San Diego... Uh, chaos theory was at 10,000 and we're already at 2400 of 9,000 so this actually shouldn't be that bad More dinosaurs yay nothing can go wrong like ever we can get more species using the expedition center this is a good idea someone once said Okay, what can we do? Who do we have? Carno, not too shabby to start with. But with the money we're making at such a low rate, we should probably go with some low dinos first, like the Nasuto. The Parasaur wouldn't be bad. Patasaur wouldn't be bad. Ceratosaur wouldn't be bad. Um, let's do the Nasuto. I want to take a look at my scientists and see if I can get a expedition thing. Extraction is a must. Refresh. I would normally get this guy. But I really don't need him right now. I don't think. I think the qu quicker I get to this, the better. And then I'll need the upgrade thing. I think it's the one below it. Nope. Which one was it? Expedition Center Extra Scientist. Oh, so it is that one I need. This one. We'll pin that. Um... Okay, so we'll work on that. Um, I know I said I'd go until the Mosasaur thing popped up, but this episode's already pushing a decent chunk of time, so I'm going to call it here. I'll do some off-cam stuff. I think the next time you see me, I'll have uh, the total dinosaur species increased, and I might even have the lagoon. I'm not too sure, but... Oh, my game is kind of laggy. At the end of the day, this is my Jurassic World, so I know the lagoon would normally go right there where I'm hovering and circling. Oh, wow. Lagging really bad. Um, but this, like I said, this is my Jurassic World, so I'm going to switch it up and do things the way I would want to. It's the whole concept of this game. Build it the way you want. But if you like this episode, don't forget to... Leave a like and subscribe, and uh, I'll catch you folks in the next one. Peace.